Hey, creating a professional looking website has never been easier. Today, I will introduce you to the best website builder service. I make over $10,000 a month and in this short video, I'm going to give you some very useful secrets that few people know about, but which make you truly the best in the best website builders category. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like it. Let's not waste time and get started. Jimdo is a purely commercial project, strong, functional and beautiful. The free plan has such restrictions that it becomes impossible to use it to create a decent website. Therefore, we will immediately focus on the fact that Jimdo, if you decide to stay on it, will require payment of one of two tariffs. Jimdo remains a pretty interesting product. Everyone will be able to use its services in English or in any other supported version, filling the site with content. Note that this engine shows itself best when building stores. There are also more convenient, affordable solutions for business cards. Although they can also be done, the functionality is sufficient for this. To summarize the introduction, Jimdo is a paid builder for good stores. Initially, you will be asked to choose one of 16 design themes. They are categorized. The templates are pretty cute, but not the best in their class. Then you can change the color scheme, font, background and also customize the appearance of individual elements. Note that a different number of templates are available at different rates. The more expensive, the correspondingly more beautiful themes you can choose. After choosing a template, you can change its structure to one of the suggested ones. For some reason, these structures are also called templates, all named after cities. With their help, you can only change the arrangement of elements on the page and not the look of the site as a whole. A bit weird and confusing approach. It turns out that there are only 16 templates. The rest are just their variations. Moreover, these templates are adaptive, unlike some of those that will be offered at the beginning. This is some kind of vinaigrette. An add-on can make a regular template responsive, also being called a template. In terms of quantity, it is also sparse, although the quality of the designs is generally good. There is a possibility to change the structure of page blocks. This will allow for a custom design. You can also upload your own template or edit the standard one through the HTML CSS editor. You can also activate the mobile versions of templates here and for each page you can set an individual background which somewhat diversifies the perception of the site. In general, the scope for working with the appearance of the site is quite extensive, although the very presentation of the choice of designs is weird. It seems that the developer simply did not want to redo the template structure of the service, simply adding add-ons with the names of cities inside the admin panel. Crookedly done, even if their quality is good. Jimdo's administrative panel is quite beautiful and easy to use, but slightly specific. The settings are very similar in design to the control panel in macOS. Everything here works in a visual editor, but there are engines in which this approach is implemented more ergonomically. Of course, here you will find standard features like adding pages, users, managing domains, SEO and more. There are no problems with the basic set, there is no point in dwelling on it in detail. Just know, Jimdo has everything you need to create your business cards, blogs and shop. You won't see about half of the functionality on the free plan. To use it, you will need to upgrade to the paid version. This is of course not very good. Could have introduced a trial for the full version for a couple of weeks so that a person could see the engine in all its glory and then pay. So that a person could see the engine in all its glory and then pay. Alas, they were greedy. Of interest is the possibility of adding widgets to expand the functionality, which for some reason was hidden in the help section. Not entirely logical. You can add multimedia players, questionnaires, social media buttons, forum callback, ad modules and more to the site. Most of the widgets will be useful when creating a store. The structure of pages in Jimdo can be easily changed. Just click anywhere and move the content areas, stretch them or adjust to the content. You can also add a gallery, image, button, product, form, map, table, file for download, video or divide the text into columns. Click the mouse and you will immediately be offered options for what can be placed on the page. You will not get confused. The system will suggest ideas for filling itself. In Jimdo, you'll work with a visual editor and use drag and drop all over the place. Honestly, there are editors of this kind that are more flexible in terms of features, convenience, but the local one is also not bad. 
The image editor Adobe Creative SDK deserves special attention. With it, without having to go to Photoshop, you can adjust a lot in images, apply effects very similar to those on Instagram, use auto enhancement, change orientation, add frames, color, overlay, focus, change color, or crop. The editor is available in the modules Image in Text and Image. Its use will be especially convenient for those who like to add photos to the site from a smartphone from a mobile application you can immediately give it the desired look. Note also that Jimbo can import products from table files. You will fall in love with this feature when creating your store. It makes it possible to fill shop windows in automatic mode. The main thing is to correctly prepare the CSV file. You can also set up discounts, delivery and payment methods, cost, compose order forms with your own hands and so on. The store can be customized in detail, which will be convenient for you and your visitors on this item offset. Now about domains. First, you will be given a free subdomain like site.jimba.com. Obviously, you have to change it to a level 2 domain. This is done simply, but to attach a domain, you need to pay for any of the two tariffs, pro or business. On the first one, you will be presented with one domain. On the second, two. The domain can be registered directly from the admin panel or bind an existing one. In general, the language does not dare to call the functionality of Jim Domiga. He is good. There is no obvious gaps, but the idea could have been implemented better. Beauty, a good level of convenience, code editing, a powerful store, widgets, a mobile version of the site, SEO statistics, and business mail plus mailing. A lot of useful things can be found in the bowels of the admin panel panel. Jimdo can hardly be called a cheap constructor, which makes it less competitive than other platforms. A free account is only good for getting to know the system, although the system provides an opportunity to use the functionality of a paid account for 30 days, but then you will need to choose one of the tariffs. Pro $65 per year, one gift domain, technical support, visit statistics module, disappearance of engine ads, mobile version of the site, the ability to customize SEO for each page and create a store for 15 products. Business $130 per year, two domains, advanced SEO settings and full store functionality for an unlimited number of products. The difference between business blog and store rates is exactly two times, as you can see, which is not good. Expensive. I also know that the tariffs provide a different amount of hosting space and differ in the quality of technical support. The more expensive, the better. You will receive everything at once only if you pay for business. Toolkit for website promotion in Jimdo is represented by a standard set for this type of system of possibilities. SEO settings, redirects, editing robots.txt, sitemap.xml, configure configuring CNC, connecting statistics collection systems. This will be enough for most users to bring the site to the top, but not everything is so smooth. The fact is that all of the above possibilities are issued in portions as the level of the tariff plan grows. On free, you will only have access to general SEO settings for the entire site. Pro will open SEO options for individual pages as well as getting up the CNC and sitemap.xml. Business unlocks robots, TXT editing and redirect management. This fragmentation of basic necessary capabilities doesn't look particularly appealing. The free tariff generally loses its relevance. There is no normal domain. SEO cannot be configured. It also turns out that you need to pay for business to get a full package of SEO settings. In general, those who want to create a business card will be deprived of not only store bonds but also part of the functionality necessary for promotion. Not good. Developers might not be so greedy. The rest of the system does not restrict the user in any way. Buy links, organize internal linking, integration with social networks, write SEO optimized unique text, set up contextual advertising, and monitor statistics directly from the control panel. There are no problems with this. These things work and help to promote your site in the same way as any other builder. The main thing is to use all these possibilities as efficiently and fully as possible.